one it should be nowadays if we buy any flagship or medium smartphone we will see the port via the charge is USB type C whereas previously if you buy a flagship or medium smartphone they were charged by micro USB port but why has smartphone companies have moved from micro USB to USB type C in this video we will explore the answer of this question watch this video till the end If you want to plug your smartphone with micro USB port, you have to plug it in one direction otherwise it won't plug in. On the other hand, if you plug USB type C connector in either two directions, it will connect. Although both micro USB and USB type C are rated to survive up to 10,000 in insertion cycles, but according to a test done by Linus Tech Tips YouTube channel, after 8000 insertion cycles, micro USB stopped functioning, whereas USB Type-C was still functioning. If you want to watch that video, the link will be in the description. A standard micro USB connector can transfer data up to 480p megabits per second. But if you get the right USB Type-C connector, you can get the data transferring speed up to 10 gigabits per second which is insane a micro usb charger can charge your phone up to power of only 15 watts whereas usb type c can charge your smartphone up to power of 100 watts due to this we see many first chargers like qualcomm's quick charge oppo superbook huawei supercharge and many more although we know usb type c supports up to 100 watt power output but oppo somehow managed to make 125 watt charger with usb type c connector which can charge a 4000 mAh battery in just 20 minutes which is insane here comes the end of this video thanks for watching please like and share this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel so bye and see you again at the next one